Good morning, Red Devils. I'm Jennifer, and this is your Red Devils Review. One, two, three. Students, if you still need to pick up any textbooks, textbook pickups start at 8 a.m. on Tuesday, Thursday, and at 2.30 on Wednesdays. Meal distribution is going to be on Tuesday at 11 a.m. if you want to pick up any food. LPAC testing is still going on this week, so good luck to any Red Devils who are taking it. Make sure you eat well before the test, get a good night's sleep, rest, and make sure to study. Hello? Good luck, you got this. As Thursday, 45 p.m., there's going to be an ICC workshop. Tuesday, March 9th, there's an admin meeting at 10 a.m. Hi, my name is Carol Hernandez, and I was class of 2017, and I took AP Psych my junior year. Although it was a difficult class, I enjoyed learning about the mental health and medication. So I'll be studying or majoring in psych. My name is Lorena, I'm class of 2018 and I go to UC Santa Barbara. Uh, I'm a psych major and the reason I picked psych is because I took AP Psych in high school and I passed and even though I'm not able to take any like psychology classes because it was all covered by my prereqs, um, I'm really excited to just head on to my upper division classes because everything else was covered by my just like my AP Psych score and like people tell you that it doesn't count if you're going to major in it and that's a lie because it did count for me so take AP classes. Students who are part of CSF collections for this week are going to be Thursday, March 11th from 7.45 to 8.45 a.m. and Friday, March 12th from 2.45 to 4 p.m. Remember to bring your mask and that it's going to be by the solar panel parking lot off of 28th Street and to put your money in an envelope. They will not be allowed to give out any uh, change, so make sure to have the correct amount or else it's going to go to donations. Thank you. Hey guys, it's Mecha here. I'm Alessandra Loano from Community Service. Mecha stands for Movimiento Estudiantil Chicano de Azotlan. It's a student organization that promotes higher education, cultura, and historia. Anyone can join this club. Or every other Wednesday during lunch at 1220 through Google Meet. Um, you can text us on our Instagram at suhaimecha20.21 regarding the Google Classroom code. And yeah, make sure to be there because what else do you have to do? Nothing. Like, you don't be doing homework. And we can help you with that. So. Hey guys, it is Alondra from Metra, and I just want to let you guys know that we do have an Instagram page. It is suhaimetra20.21, and we do post upcoming meeting dates and upcoming events. Make sure to go check that out, and bye guys. What's up, Red Devils? Thank you guys for the support on the very first episode of the Speaking of the Devil podcast. It did way better than I would have ever thought, especially on a one-hour video. But episode two is now out. It is featuring my co-president, Shayra, and we go over declining cases, school reopening, and relationships between a teenager and their parents. So if you want to go check that out, episode two is now on. Hey Red Devils, if you didn't know already, sports are starting again. You get, get currently cleared for cross country, swim, football, tennis, track, and soccer. Starting March 8th, you could get cleared for softball and baseball. And on March 10th, you could get cleared for cheer. Make sure you check out Coach Huckabee's email all about clearances and all the forms and steps necessary for it. In those emails, you will find out the zoom meeting link for those online clearances meetings and one that's happening is march 13th from 9 a.m to 12 p.m and for the in-person meetings for the clearances they're going to be monday tuesday wednesday from 2 30 to 4 30. it's going to happen on near the solar panels that's where you can pick up your hard copy forms for the clearances and just a little quick summary about what's on the email and the steps for the clearances. You do need a physical, a complete register my athlete, 
and you need to have it printed and signed physically by yourself and your parent. You need to print and sign the COVID waiver form. And if a athlete has had a positive COVID test, they will need a um, second medical reference clearance form that's attached in the COVID waiver form at the back. And you also need a negative COVID test after the date of February 1st. If you know anyone who's part of SWIM, wish them luck on their first meet Thursday at 5 p.m. against Chula Vista at Parkway Pool. Good luck, Red Devils! There is a photo contest with a theme of water at home. The deadline for the contest is March 19 at 5 p.m. You can enter up to three photos for each category, the color and the black and white photos. The prizes for first place is 400, second, 300, and third, 200. Good luck to any Red Devils who enter. Well, that's all I have for you today, Red Devils. I've been Jennifer, and this has been your Red Devils Review. Make it a great day, or not. The choice is always yours.